it's kind of like a perfect storm. Uh, and the people that are coming through that portal not only are sicker, but most of the time are less likely to have the ability to pay fully for those services. Mm-hmm. And so it's economic downturns are, are bad. They're bad for everyone. We are keeping an eye on our operational efficiencies and um, involving staff and our physicians on how we can save money and reduce waste. Um, the staff is taking great pride and loyalty of, of working here and um, treating it like it's their own checkbook. We, we, we're seeing our revenues tighten up. We've seen uh, the people that we serve uh, being far more resource uh, intensive. Uh, in layman's terms, that means they're sicker when they get here, and it takes us more money to to, to uh, alleviate their their illness. Obviously, on the patient side, we have seen an increase in our self-paid clientele, and also our Medicare population, and, and um, a decrease on the managed care side. So it's evident that people are losing their jobs and losing their benefits, and more so in the last quarter of 2008, we saw a significant increase in our self-pay and our charity care um, expenses. And, and we see it uh, probably a little bit more uh, vivid than some places in that our community is a predominantly Medicare retirement community. Uh, at the age that people are the most likely to consume health care, we're seeing these people back away from it a little bit if they can any way get by it. I think we're, we're seeing the, the market shift to um, actually even going closer and closer to, to a higher Medicare level, and um, especially with our population, the age of our population in this area. And our Medicaid is also increasing, which is the younger population. So um, I think that that's just a sign of the times with our job loss. In general terms, we've, we've put a plan together that, uh, number one, uh, reduces uh, our operating costs, while purposely not infringing upon uh, the the quality of care that we have been famous for providing here at this hospital. Um, as a facility, we're uh, concentrating on operational efficiency, trying to make sure that we are paying attention to things that we always are paying attention to. Uh, we did not lay off anyone. We have no desire nor intention to lay off anyone. Our directors and above, our senior directors and above, have um, foregone in the la- end of 2008 their 2009 salary increases. We don't feel like that there's anything that we've suspended that cannot be uh, very, very quickly reinstated uh, when financial stability uh, uh, has arrived. Um, and reaching the economies of scale. It's very nice being part of a large healthcare system. Uh, we think we have a, a good formula of operation at us, but we've enjoyed, uh, I've been here 17 years, we've enjoyed 15 to 17 years firmly in the black. By providing quality care and excellent patient outcomes, patients are stopping here, whereas before they were driving white bias to go to other facilities. So we are experiencing um, an increase in our volumes, which, which we're excited about. So to continue that patient focus and to continue to focus on the care and the quality of care in order for the patients and the physicians to want to come, continue to come here and not have to travel outside the county to have their health care done. We go into this, this process a um, very solvent, very sound institution. And our plan is to, when we come out of it, to be a very sound and uh, uh, prosperous organization that's in position to meet the challenges that continued growth will bring to us.